You, you better, you better say the Yankees are World Series contenders, Felix Hummel. Beat your ass, boy. You better, you better, you better say it right now, boy. <laughs> What is up, Yankees fans? This is Felix from NYNews.com yet again with another video. Let's talk about my previous video on why I think the Yankees are in big trouble right now. People kept saying, oh, you're such a hypocrite, but they didn't exactly say that, but that's what they meant. You're such a hypocrite. I thought you said the Yankees were automatic World Series contenders. Well, not when CC Sabathia is not performing, not when you have question marks with Sonny Gray, and even Tanaka being as consistent, you don't know what you're going to get from <laughs> those two. Then uh, throw in CC Sabathia to the mix. I mean, that's just a blow to your starting rotation and to your team, especially when your bullpen as well has question marks and is inconsistent as well. So that's what I meant. I think the Yankees, they need to go out there and get two starting pitchers. I don't think they need one. I think they need two. And I think if CeCe Sabathia continues to struggle, I think CeCe Sabathia is going to be one of those pitchers that the Yankees look at and say, hey, maybe we got to cut this guy loose. Who knows? I, I like CeCe Sabathia, but he needs to perform. He's going up there in age, and if he can't win ball games for the Yankees, if he's giving up a whole bunch of runs, then I see no reason to keep him in this rotation when you have so many young arms in your farm system and you can make trades four aces literally you could trade four two aces if the, if the Yankees wanted to maybe an ace that is owed millions of dollars and it wouldn't take that many prospects but maybe salary the Yankees could do that so I don't know we got to see how CeCe Sabathia performs today I hope he pitches a good game I hope that's not the case but like I said I'm not gonna lie to you guys and say hey the Yankees are World Series contenders because as of now they're not the Red Sox are another 100 win team another 100 win team you can't let's say stay in a race when your starting rotation is inconsistent and like I said sometimes your bullpen is as well so I'm just being realistic with you guys I'm not gonna lie to you guys yeah a week ago the Yankees or two weeks ago were unstoppable, but this is the story with the 2018 Yankees. We all saw in the beginning of the season, they were pr practically one of the worst so-called hyped-up teams out there. They were like 9-9, and -9, then they went on this um, winning streak because the pitching was consistent. CeCe Sabathia was pitching good games. The only question mark really was Sonny Gray, but now we have like, what, four question marks? We even have Domingo Hormon. Having four starts and out of three starts, the Yankees do not win. And the Yankees, as of now, are giving him a fifth start. So instead of uh, experimenting with your form, putting another pitcher in that spot, the Yankees just continue to experiment with Herman. And I think that's a mistake. They have the perfect situation to experiment, to see what they have. So when it comes to the trade deadline, you might not have to give up that many prospects. You might strike gold in your farm system. So that's the only problem I have with the well, with the what the Yankees are doing. We all knew that they had to get a starting pitcher come the off season, but they didn't. So this is where they find themselves. Like I said, you're not going to keep up with the Red Sox if CC Sabathia is struggling. Simple as that, even if Tanaka's struggling as well. Tanaka pitched a great game, but he's another inconsistent pitcher. So we have so many question marks. That's what I mean, that the Yankees are probably going to get B in serious trouble soon because we don't have – we only have one pitcher in, our, in the Yankees rotation that is performing as an ace, and the rest are question marks. That's what I mean. How could you possibly keep up with the Red Sox when they are another 100-win team? That's all I mean. So let's be realistic here, folks. That's all I'm saying. Yes, it probably makes me look like a hypocrite, but I'm just being real with you guys. The Yankees had a long streak where they were practically unstoppable, but now look at them again. They are inconsistent. So the Yankees need to make a few moves. That's just my opinion. 
And like always, Yankees fans, share and like and subscribe. This has been Felix from NYNews.com, and I'll check you out next time.